What's popping collective? This is the spiritual assassin. And I'm telling you guys to go with the flow. I just got a visualization. So whatever it is, guys, just go with the flow and let source work magic for you in your life. That message could be for someone. Um, but welcome, guys. I am your host today, the spiritual assassin. These messages are for my Virgos. So without further ado, let's go ahead and tap into these messages. Remember, energies are interchangeable. You already know what that means if you are into tarot land. All right, guys. So take what resonates and disregard the rest. Let's go. Let's go ahead and tap into these messages. The pre-shuffle messages I have for you guys is there is a king of cups here, um, a um, cancer cancer pisces scorpio who's very emotional this person can be married um this person is very loving and kind kind um this person is a father um this person um d does have a lot of love to give out towards his community and the people he loves um he could both be most definitely a pisces who i'm talking to but i see that this king of cups is fighting uh energy um Actually, he's fighting this emperor, empress in the reverse. This empress in the reverse is in a page of wands energy. So you already know who this king, this king, this empress in the reverse is someone who's very weak, someone who's not nurturing, someone um, who's not, who doesn't have the mother skills or the nurturing skills to nurture a relationship. This person is not divinely guided by the universe. Um, this person is disconnected by, from nature. Also, this person is, um, with the judgment card in the reverse, this person lacks remorse. They don't care about nobody but their self. Even when source tries to come in and try to bring judgment to a situation, they're still trying to go above source, but they are narcissistic. They're arrogant. Um, they think that they are in control of this destiny. Is what I'm picking up. Maybe somebody was calling on some, some ancestors here. Maybe somebody was trying to raise the dead up. Was she trying to use magic on you guys? To bring some kind of harm? To bring some kind of type of judgment to you guys? She could have tried to use some type of graveyard magic on the King of Cups to keep them from coming towards you but this person is very stingy this person takes everything for granted now your person is fighting to get away from this energy all right so what i'm picking up is there's an emperor in the reverse who's in this young energy that um could possibly use graveyard magic to try to keep a person stuck to them or keep you in disdain so he won't give to you because this person is stingy because she wants because she wants to stay attached to this energy. Now your person is fighting to get away from this energy because she will not accept the fate to where he has gave her. I feel like God is gonna come in and going to rule the ultimate fate of this situation, is what I'm picking up. So let's continue with the other pre-shuffle messages. Yes, we have the two of swords here. Somebody was being indecisive. But somebody was using magic on this person to make them choose them over you. Somebody manipulated, somebody manifested, somebody um, used magic, like I told y'all, in this connection to get with someone. that. And you was wondering why your person didn't come towards you is because they somebody used magic on them and they end up choosing to be with the other person is what I'm picking up. Yeah. This King of Swords right here chose to go back towards this person that he possibly called judgment on in the past so he's going through karma for picking this person all over again this person could be harsh cruel nasty at the mouth cuss people real hard real tough with the um king of swords yeah somebody's watching his money somebody he could be watching his money but somebody's watching that money somebody watching somebody money here you're gonna get com quick. Com you're gonna get quick, fast communication that coming in about this scenario with the uh, Eight of Wands in a reverse. It's gonna be uncontrollable, um, fast communication. Maybe this person couldn't communicate with you because he was in the Eight of Swords energy because he was stuck, and he could have been stuck. In a situation he couldn't control anymore. 
and maybe this is a message that, that you're going to receive. This situation will be justified out. The truth will be told and the skills will be balanced about this person that is uh, a fake light worker is what I'm picking up. Somebody who is not divinely guided. So we're going to put these decks together and we're going to get these messages. Okay, guys. So we got an empress in a reverse that ain't shit out here, guys. This mug is still in this young ass energy. You can't be an empress and page and be a page of wands. Her real energy is a page of wands. That's not trying to stop this judgment from happening. Or she's trying to reverse this judgment. I feel like that she's also doing graveyard magic too. To keep somebody stuck to her. Confirmation. Yeah, now your person fighting, fighting for their life, fighting the community off, fighting this person off. That he gave an emotional offer to. So people going through karma right now. What's the energies? Source, spirit, spirit gods, ancestors, creator, all deities. I welcome you to my energies. Thank you for delivering these messages to me. Let's go. What's going on with this energy? Yeah, there's Knight of Swords energy. Somebody very nasty, uh, controlling someone who has a foul ass mouth, young ass energy, ready to fly off at the mouth at any time. Somebody is ready to fight here. Yeah, this Queen of Pentacles right here. She could be pregnant or she could uh, have, have lost a child, but she's pissed off right now. And she's ready to fight. Yes, she's ready to fight you, the Six of Wands energy. You could be successful. She could be trying to come towards you and fight you. I know this pregnant woman ain't trying to come towards you and fight you because your person see you as a, a victory. Man, let me clarify this. Can you clarify the six of wands? Yeah, because your person wanted to travel to calm waters with you with the six of wands. This person wants to fight you. This this situation is going to be um, just as will be brought to this situation. But this person is watching your person money, their pinnacles. Your person is fighting this energy off with the seven of wands. This person feels like that she's entitled to having your person money to gaining whatever he gains. She wants to have it. She is not letting go of these coins. She is trying not to let go of these coins. And she is sit over here seriously uh, watching every coin he makes. She could be trying to fight you for these coins so he don't come and give to you. And she's using magic and ma manipulation to keep this connection together. She's using sex magic, graveyard magic. Um, she's using um, all anything, um, jar spells to keep this person stuck in, in this love affair, guys. Any more messages? Yeah, this high priestess in the reverse. Told you she using magic. I told you. Yeah, she using fucking magic. She manipulating like hell. Yep. Yeah, this Knight of Wands energy right here. This person was only coming in for a short time, not a long time. She just wanted some ding -ling or some or masculine wanted some cuckoo. And they that's all they wanted. The money, the sex, and leave. Money, sex, and leave. Money, sex, and leave. That's let me name that. Let me write that down. That's all they wanted. They don't, there's no love here. That's all she was in. Uh, that's why all she, that's, that's the only reason why she is in this connection is to continue to get that moolah. And she's pissed off because your person is choosing to leave her to come towards you. And she's pissed off and she wants to fight you now because you're coming in and taking over her money. She feels like it's her money. Okay. Yeah, she, your person was in a false-ass relationship with this person, Ten of Cups. This family is going through upheavals right now. They are unhappy. They are lacking. There's no emotional love here. The kids ain't happy here. The, your masculine not happy here. Yeah, they went through a tower moment. When, once he uh, went through this tower moment with this person, we, he offered this person this Ace of Wands and turned around and had a tower moment with this person. Damn. He brought death to the situation.
because of some information that was displayed. Yeah, he's walking off in regret now because some, something has happened. God has intervened and has made sure that this situation will not happen again. Who is this Ace of Wands? Somebody he gave a lot of... The Ace of Wands clarified is with the Seven of Cups in the reverse. So he committed to someone who's non-committal. Damn. Damn. How that? Yeah, she backstabbed him more than 10 times, and she did it one more time. <laughs> more than 10 times. Yeah, this person was only had delays for this person. She was only setting him back. This was a setup for a setback. She was going to keep him delayed, and as he continued to keep dealing with this cycle, she's going to always keep him delayed because he chose to go back to karmic energy. After he done learned his lesson, he still went back and got betrayed again there's no growth here all she's gonna do is drag you to hell and make you lose every damn thing yeah that's your lover though any more messages yeah now you in regret with the six of cups here you in regret now that you got this person pregnant page of cups or this could be a young ass energy that you could have got pregnant. This woman could possibly be intuitive, but she used her gifts for the wrong. Now you're working real hard towards something. You was working real hard towards this page of swords energy. Yo, so this energy you went towards masculine. You was, this is not for all masculines, okay, guys? So please take what resonate. You choose to go to these this young ass energy. It could be two young energies in here. That you got pregnant. It could be up to two young energies you got pregnant. But nah, I feel like that this 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 is that emperor in the reverse. She's pulling out all the mask in this reading. <laughs> Ten forty three on the screen. She could be a Sagittarian. Somebody's getting laughed at right now. <laughs> the visions I have, y'all, is crazy. But anyway, let's continue. Yeah, but um, <laughs> my ancestors are a trip. My ancestors are a mess. Yeah, but this is a young energy who you got pregnant, somebody who's nasty as hell at the mouth, and you worked real hard to get with this person only to get backstabbed. Damn, three of cups. <laughs> she backstabbed you again with somebody else. Yeah, you picked the wrong fucking business partner. Yes, yeah, she did, but the three of pentacles in the reverse. This could be a, a a bad uh contract, a bad marriage, or a bad uh friendship that went up went upside down. Yeah, that's why you're in regret. Yeah, you got dang offered her this cup of love right here. You was being indecisive of who you was gonna choose, and you chose the wrong one. You didn't know these secrets was in the background with that crescent moon in the background. No, nah, you didn't know that. Nope. You had to walk away from these cups because they wasn't fulfilling because you found out a secret with the moon in the background. Yeah, you was in despair, disdain. You were sad, but you had no choice but to walk away because this was the, the straw that broke the camel back is what I'm picking up. Yeah, it left you stuck in your head all over again. You keep repeating the same cycle over and over and over again, and you're not going to learn your lesson until <laughs> it happens again, I guess. I guess you're not learning your lesson. Are you Have you learned your lesson yet? Are you learning your lesson? Have you realized this person is toxic and it's the devil? Okay. This lover you with that keeps that leaves you exhausted every time y'all connect. <laughs> Any more energies? Yeah, you was in the two of cups with this devil ass energy. What I tell you? The devil in the reverse here. <laughs> You're, you are detaching away from the devil now. You you now see that this relationship was uh from <laughs> not from the divine from the divine but from Satan himself. That's her master. Confirmation. <laughs> yeah. You you couldn't offer this pinnacle to a uh, divine feminine because you were steady, got that offering to this devil ass energy. Not only that, but she was slow to commit to you because she wasn't ready for commitment because she was in another relationship dealing with other people. Damn. 
Yeah, this is not King of Pentacles in a, in a reverse. She gets her money in all kind of ways. So, she, of course, she couldn't be committed towards you because she's making money with other people. You own, you just another on my to-do list. She checks you off and go to the next one to collect her money. But you didn't see that. Yeah, this person is very bossy and domineering. She bosses over you, looks down, uh, looks down on you, doesn't respect you. You give her what she want, and then she leave. Get that bag, that bread, and leave. That's what she do. She get that money, sex, and leave. That's what she do. Yeah, eight of wands in the reverse here. Now, this person is losing control because they they have no control over you now. Their duty was to um, control you and your funds, and now they have no um, way of doing it. Obviously, you must have caught, brung death to the situation. Um, I see that you brung judgment, the tower card being here, but she's still not willing to give up. Well, she is very relentless at what she's doing. Any more messages before I end this read? Yeah, but you're meditating here with the four of wands from this Aquarian energy in the reverse. This could be a pale woman, white woman, light-skinned woman, blonde hair. She is not divinely guided. She's not healing. She, her emotions is dried up. Yeah, this Queen of Cups right here who manipulates, who emotionally manipulates men to get what they want. Yeah, she manipulated you in this family, this Four of Wands energy. Yeah, this fake ass love affair. Any more messages? You started a fool with this person. This is it. Yeah, you gave her this Ace of Pentacles. You gave this gift, give, God gave you a gift and you took it and fumbled it on a god dang, uh, the devil. Yeah, on somebody who wasn't healed. Damn. And I'm going to get one more and I'm done. That's it. And that's the motherfucking truth. <laughs> yeah. You had a... You started a family with this queen of uh, queen of swords. You got damn knew this motherfucker was, wasn't right. From how I'm looking at it with this queen of swords, she she nasty with it. She a fool with it. She got damn cussing your ass out, possibly cussing out your damn kids too. She nasty as fuck. You had started some type of um, business with this person, some type of um, generational wealth with this person. This person was self-absorbed. That's all they wanted was your money. They was not divinely guided, period. Now this person brings a bunch of burdens on you. Yes. Now you're getting a different perspective of this person. Guys, do not take that. Yeah, and that's the damn truth. And this person is not ready to let you go. That's how bad it is. This motherfucker is toxic. Let me tell you, OMG. Guys, that is the read I have for you guys this morning. I hope and pray for better days for you guys. I'm not talking to the Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine, you doing good out here. You getting uh, um, achievements and accolades from the community, so you keep doing what you're doing. And he's trying to come towards you with all this drama. I think the fuck not. <laughs> keep that shit over there. <laughs> you need to get that person at your energy. Uh-uh. Get a restraining order. Get something. Because this energy right here ain't right at all. Well, guys, that's all I have for you guys. I hope that these messages bring you some type of clarity on the next move to make in your life. If you need a private reading, please contact me at creativeilluminations.net or on Facebook, Creative Illuminations, my business page. Or you can connect me, connect me with my um personal facebook page under star seat talk to you guys soon love and light talk to you soon bye